Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is uh, Gregory Martin, aka the Super Producer. Um, today we are doing something a little different. Um, we are not in my normal digs. We are on the roof. And I want to do this uh, just one just to kind of break up the monotony like uh, I mean with all that's going on in the world and 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 um, in the city and things like th things of that nature you know I just didn't feel like you know shooting this in the in, inside my apartment I want to be just more outside um, uh, in the elements um, it's a beautiful day out today in New York City uh, I mean I'm not sure if you guys can tell behind me I mean I can feel it the sun's right behind me this is sunny out it's a little chilly um, I think it's a little chillier up, up on the roof instead uh, it's, it's chill, probably chillier up here than, than it is down on the street level but uh, yeah I just wanted to want to do this guys and just kind of just uh, just talk um, uh, because this whole uh, virus situation has really put a damper on a lot of things. Uh, you know, I'm not, so I finally decided, you know, after, I think on like, I think middle of last week, I decided that I'm not going to attend the, the Cannes Film Festival. Um, you know, there's just right now, for me, there's just way too much too much uncertainty. Um, with South by uh, canceling, um, some of these other film festivals canceling. Um, uh, I mean, I haven't heard anything from like Tribeca. Uh, I think they're still trying to push forward, but like with the with the new restrictions that they've put in place in New York City of of gather, gatherings. Of more than 500 people, um, you know, even the movie theaters—they're cutting, they're cutting their uh, their seating capacity, cap uh, their seating capacity. They're no, they're no longer filling at 100% um, just to uh, combat the uh, the virus. Like with all of that going on, and then just economically, you know. Uh, you know, events that I, I typically count on uh, for revenue, um, and just a, just just a whole bunch of shit, guys, have kind of led me to the to that decision, and to where now I think it's it, it'd be more it'd be more responsible just to set pat and just uh, to wait to this this whole thing clears you know um you know I, I think i think definitely the virus is something that is very serious and we all need to be aware of and take the you know the the right precautions uh to to prevent you know either yourself from 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 getting it um those close to you um and then also uh those who are um more prone to to be uh um to be affected by it so you know i, I i've uh yeah my, my my whole situation has changed I've, I've just i'm moving ever since last since monday i've been moving differently um doing uh I'm, i'll be doing a lot more work from home nowadays um um I'll be recording a lot more. Although the, the week that I didn't record, I have no excuse. I have no excuse not to record now. Um, and I don't know. I, I think you know some of the things that I, that you know the the movie reviews and, and things of that nature. Um, I think I I, I I have to skip a lot of those. Um, I, I may be doing. I might I might review movies that are on that are on uh, Netflix um, or Amazon Prime exclusives things like that um, 
but yeah, I mean, it, like this, it's, 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 it's stuff like this that really just kind of puts you in a, in a shitty mood, uh, you know, creatively. You know, well, I mean, especially for the short term, maybe for right for right now, like I said, this 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 uh, this this entire week has been kind of like I've just been in this like not necessarily a rut. I had I hadn't been feeling really well, so I think that contributed to to my uh, not wanting to do anything as well. Um, you know, nothing serious. I just had like uh, you know some uh, you know some some body aches, which is kind of par for the course after I do some of these uh, events you know I just you know so but you know this time I just want to be more precautious uh, to not be around others uh, just to you know just to make sure that you know I'm fine you know which I am um, but um, I don't know I, I think I think this I think this time that you know that you know some of us are going to have, you know, I, I know a lot of my friends are going to are going are going to have to start working from home, um, or just uh, you know, or some or some some businesses are just, uh, you know, they're not going to be able to survive, you know, um, you know, so you know, depending on where you are, you know, you're you're affected one way or the other. Um, so you know, you know, all we can do is like kind of just. Uh, you know, hold each other down um, in a way. You know, just to you know make sure we're we're being uh, good citizens. Good citizens. Um, you know, because this this time is this this time is hard for everybody. Um, I saw a, I read a story this morning that really, that kind of pissed me off about this uh, couple in Canada. Who bought like uh, seventy thousand dollars worth of like disinfectant wipes, and like we're flipping it and trying to s and selling it on like Amazon for like four to five times as much as they paid for it. And I mean, luckily Amazon, you know, stepped in and they did the right thing and, and shut them down. But just the, the people's, you know, people's attitude in this in this crisis and and. And like I said, like I, like I think I said in my in my pre previous video, I think I think this may be a little bit overblown. Um, I mean, I, re I remember when uh, H1N1 hit uh, a couple years ago, or uh, what, what, what was that Obama or whatever things. Yeah, it was it was a big deal, but you know it was handled you know really well, and you know I, I don't think there was. Well, I don't recall any like big, big uh, panic. Um, I mean, in New York City, things I, I think things went on by clockwork, and I'm, I'm pretty sure it, the same thing happened um, in other parts of the country in the world. Um, but it, but it is a little it is a little disheartening to see like you know some bad actors out there. Who are you know taking taking advantage of the situation? Um, you know, uh, I mean, I'm not I'm not gonna, I'm not I'm not gonna get into a rant on that. Um, but um, yeah, I mean, this as as a content creator, um, as, as someone who has who is going to who has uh, decided to use you know this platform to uh, to uh, you know, do videos and and and, um, and create material. I think this is definitely a good time to, you know, if if you didn't have time before, you know, you know, especially those who are you know working, you know, second second gigs, you know, you know, to to, to make ends meet, and then also your creator. This is a great time for you to, you know, you know put pen to pad or, or whatever or or do something I, I think this this time um, you know should definitely be used to do something positive um, you know to get your mind get our minds away from you know the things that are happening and happening in the world I mean even now like I mean I still see people like uh, playing basketball I mean business businesses are open 
Um, the streets aren't as busy as they normally are for Saturday at this time. But um, I mean, at the, end the, at the end of the day, we gotta live our lives. We gotta keep keep going on, keep pushing on, and make the best of uh, each situation, um, the best of each situation as we can. Um, so I don't know guys that's all I have I um, just wanted to get out here on the roof and just uh, just uh, chat with you guys um, and um, just be on lookout for my uh for my uh, my upcoming videos, I, I will be I will be posting some videos all week. You you guys gonna get tired of seeing my goddamn face. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be posting so much. Um, um, also, I've been like I said I've been I've, I've been I've been in the apartment for the past uh, four or five days, and um, some some good recommendations for movies I have. <laughs> A friend of mine, I saw, I read on Twitter, had uh, posted he had uh, he had watched How High Two with the little Yachty, and I mean he's a he's a he's a very he's a he's a brave individual. I don't know how he made it through that through that entire film, but um, if you if you guys do want to uh, you know some material to check out, you know during this time, I did watch. Uh, and I think it's, and it's been out for maybe a few weeks. Uh, Spencer, Spencer Confidential with with uh, Mark Wahlberg and Winston Duke. I recommend that if you if you're an action junkie. Um, this to me it felt like uh, the film felt like very felt like classic Wahlberg. Um, so you guys should check that out. Um, I saw The Foreigner with with Jackie Chan and um, what's his name Pierce Brosnan. That was really good, um, and right now I'm watching this. I'm watching this TV series on Netflix called uh, "I Am Not." I, I forget. I forget the. I forget the title of it, but it's a. Uh, it's a very interesting uh, TV series. It's, it's this. Uh, it's about this this girl who, um, this high schooler who is kind of going through this phase of she's. You know, her father passed away, and she's just having a hard time in high school. And she may have uh, superpowers. Uh, so it's a very interesting uh, uh, series so far. So you guys should check that out. Um, other than that, I'm gonna get off this roof so I don't catch a cold. And um, I will see you guys uh, later this week with the uh, the next video. All right. Peace.